What's good, YouTube? Y'all know the vibes. We back again with another day for day production. All right, so today we out here. We outside today, yo. The weather, it's a beautiful day in New York. It's about 55 degrees. And we gonna get into this Q&A mukbang. Feel me? I'm at Buffalo Wild Wings right now. I'm about to grab this food real quick. We got a lot of questions to get into. I'm gonna answer them as in-depth and as thorough as possible. So, I'm gonna wait for this food and we gonna get back to the, the next clip. Alright, what's good, YouTube? Back again, we doing this Wild Wings Mukbang. I got some bonus right here. Hope y'all can see that. A little bit of wedges, I'm not trying to move the camera. But you know what's going on. Alright, so question number one. Mm -hmm. Okay, now, there you are. I was trying to eat outside, but these seagulls are acting crazy. I don't even have time for this right now. So I'm saying, you know what? You have to stay outside. They're not about to mess up my video. <laughs> but, question number one How tall am I? Enjoy slaps, honey barbecue. Let me just finish chewing this. I'm five feet eight. Um, not a giant, <laughs> but I'm not a midget. So I'm in between decent size, but I'm sturdy too. So you know what I'm saying? That makes up for it. <laughs> Question number two. I got a lot of these questions, mainly because of working out. Um, everybody sees me in the gym, they wonder, you know, how I maintain such a good physique, how much do I weigh, etc. like that. I weigh in between like 170, 165 to 170, you know what I'm saying? It goes up and down, you know, goes up and fluctuates depending on how much I eat that week, you know what I'm saying? Or how much I actually work out. Because your muscles also add weight. I probably have like 10% body fat. Not a lot. But I generally spend a lot of time in the gym. So I feel like that's the reason why my body fat percentage is so low as well. Um, third question. How old are you? Funny thing about this meal right now, I'm even eating. It was a birthday special. Got it for free. So my birthday just recently passed. It's about, what is it? It's February, what, 4th? Hey, wow, it's February 4th, a full month ago. My birthday was January 4th. And I turned 24 years of age. <clears throat> I'm getting up there. But I'm still young. Next question, do you take steroids? <laughs> That's the number one question. That's the most funniest question too. I don't understand why when it comes to working out in the gym, everything has to be cheating. You know, it's amazing the scenarios and the, you know what I'm saying? Things people be coming up with to say that you cheated to get where you're at. Or they're gonna say the typical, oh, it's because of the color of your skin, why you look like that. Bro, what? Like, how does that even make any sense? Nothing is ever tied back to working hard. Everything, people just wanna misconstrue and make it sound the way they want it to sound so that they feel good. But yeah, I don't take steroids, bro. I work out about five to six days a week, depending on how my body's feeling. Um, hour and a half, hour to hour and a half a day. Not too long. I mean, it might be long for you, I don't know. But it's not long for me. I'm a type, I could just sit in the gym and just chill <laughs> for like three hours and wouldn't even realize. Oh, if somebody called me, I look at the time, like, oh shit, I'm in the gym for mad long. But, yeah. I usually take off Monday and Wednesdays, and I go Tuesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, I'm like, oh, why? 
why don't you have any splits in between your days? How are you working out so long? Mainly because the gym is too packed. Yo, these birds are going crazy, bro. He got kind of close, so I'm gonna close my door. I don't got time for these dudes. <laughs> but anyways, mainly because, oh my goodness. Yo, Brody, I'm shooting a video, bro. Hey, <laughs> you in a in the woo woo now? <laughs> Alright, I'm hit you back. But yeah, that's my bro Stacks. Hey, <laughs> shout out to Stacks, man. Back right after I go Tuesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, mainly because the gym is too packed. There's about 60 people in there at a time. And that's ridiculous. You know, when I go to the gym, like I said, you guys see my circuit video. If you haven't seen it, the circuit video is up. <laughs> my workout circuit. My leg one is on the way soon. I'm gonna do a leg one soon. Um, I do a circuit, so I like to be moving around and stay active in the gym so I can work up a sweat. Um, but 60 people in the gym, it's, oh, bro, how much sit you have left? Bro, how much sit you have left? That's too much time, man. That's too much in between. That's too much talking. <laughs> When I'm in the gym, I be serious. Like, it's not a game. I'm going there to get my workout in and get out. So, when I go on Wednesdays, when I go on Thursdays, typically, nobody really there. You know what I'm saying? After 5, 6 o'clock, empty. You know what I'm saying? And so on the obvious Friday, you know nobody's there. Saturday, you know nobody's there. Sunday, you know nobody's there. So, that's why I do it that way. And it works the best in my favor because I get to do everything I want to do and don't have to worry about, you know, playing in between sets or, you know what I'm saying? Skipping things I want to do in the gym. I was on long question. <laughs> but next. What made you do YouTube? That's a big question. I've always wanted to do YouTube, you know, before I actually made this channel, like back in the day, I used to make little, um, rune, like, it's a it's an online video game, it's called RuneScape, you know, it's, it's, it's a little pixel game, what is it, MMORPG, massive multiplayer online role-playing game, that's what that stands for, and I used to make little videos about, like, little achievements in that game or whatever, whatever, so I've always been, like, into the idea of editing, uploading a video, and things like that. So, like me coming to YouTube now, is just like, now I could actually do lifestyle videos. Because you know, before when you're younger, you don't really have the funds to put up to like buy a camera and you know what I'm saying? Things like that. So it's best, you know, when you save up and you're in the right position to like do things like that. And like now would be the time where I have more free time aside from working. I can, you know, shoot videos, record videos on the weekend, give you guys content until this becomes something that's full time because that's ultimately my goal. You know what I'm saying? So I've always been into YouTube and I feel like it's the biggest platform to really reach a wide audience of people. Like you're not just reaching people around you or people, you know what I'm saying? State to state. This is worldwide, international. This is global. You know what I'm saying? There's people in my videos that comment, you know what I'm saying? Shout out to Germany. I see you in the comment section. There's people in Germany viewing my videos. And I think that's insane that, you know, we live in a time where we can touch so many people and reach so many people all across the world. Got these kids out here walking around <clears throat> looking at me like I look crazy. <laughs> but yeah, we're in a time where we can touch people all across the world. And I feel like that's I feel like that's a great opportunity and I don't think Oh yo yo what's good bro? Yeah what's good? What up? How you doing? Yeah I'm doing a video right now, I'm doing a QA. You wanna see YouTube? Day for day. Day for day? Yeah. I mean this is a QA film. You can say what's good. Yeah, I'm doing mukbang QA. Yo, what's up? I got you on my thumb. What is it? Day for day. Day for day? Day for day. Day for day. Day? Oh, day for day. Yeah, straight up. Yes, I got you. So All right, bro. I know I got you, Brody. <laughs> Holla at me, bro. <laughs> they want to be in a bed. All right, next question. Um, is that Roosevelt Field Mall in New York, bro? 
Yes, it is. I'm from Long Island, New York. I was at Roosevelt Field Mall. Sometimes I get my clips over there. I be jumping around from mall to mall. Wherever I can get clips, I'll take it. You know what I'm For my next video, though, I might have to get, I might have to go OT. Out of town. That means out of town. Because <laughs> these malls are starting to get too saturated. Um, these Robocops, mall security, they keep on trying to play around with me. Like, oh, you can't do this in here. You can't do that in the place. It's a public facility. Like, you know what I'm saying? That's another downside. When doing these public interviews, there's always somebody trying to over enforce or do more than they even supposed to. Like, just do your job, bro. You know what I'm saying? You just more security. Like, chill out. <laughs> Maybe doing too much. So, um, the next question as well is this is another workout question. It says, what's, what's the best way to burn fat on stomach? I don't have it much, but I've been struggling to take the last bits of it so I can have a six pack. All right. So the best thing to burn fat would be to change your diet. Um, you basically got to focus on diet because when you're burning your fat, you're basically just, you know, okay, you're burning down. You want to show your abs. You want to basically burn and tone down the fat in your abdominal region. So basically, first, your diet is that's obviously number one. You know what I'm saying? What you're putting into your body is what's putting that layer of fat over your abdominal region. So if you change your diet and you're eating more healthy, then you're not going to be building up as many fats. Makes sense? All right, cool. So next, and also, it in turn, you have to be working out consistently. Um, abs is the only muscle group that you can do every day. So take that in mind, for example. You can hit abs as many times as you want every day. So if you go into the gym, uh, even at home, you got to do the extras. You know what I'm saying? It's all about extras. That's another thing we're working on. It's all about the extras. You could go to the gym. You could work out. But if you're not eating right, if you're not, uh, you know, I'm home right now. I'm watching a little TV. Let me drop down and do a little ab set. You know what I'm saying? Have an ab wheel at home. You could get on the ground, do some abs. Perfect. You know what I'm saying? That's just the additional that sets you ahead. You know what I'm saying? It's not just the gym. You have that additional workout that no one sees you're doing, you're, you are doing, and that puts you ahead of the pack. You know what I'm saying? So you also got to be working out and doing... There's also, I'm going to do an ab workout video as well, because it's hard for me to tell you guys, because I would be telling you guys workouts throughout this Q&A instead of just asking the questions, but I'm also going to upload an ab workout video. So as long as you're hitting abs consistently and taking your time, you'll be good. Okay, these kids came back. I don't know what they on. Yeah, what's how, good? how do you spell your, your YouTube? Uh, straight up, like don't, don't do no spaces, just put day for day. Like how you spell day? D-A-Y. F O R D A Y. Alright, so type that in. Just straight, no spaces. It's gonna come up. <laughs> They're trying to watch the video through the back. <laughs> but yeah. Alright. So. Nah, 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 nah. That's the car club, Brody. Oh, <laughs> I got you. Have B faces? Hold on, I got you. Nigga, you said his YouTube, not his Instagram. Yeah, that's just a car club. It's right here. It's the first one. <laughs> right, oh, it's Dave. Alright, bro. Good looks, man. Right. Shit. They came back. <laughs> they said, nah, I gotta get his channel. Who's this dude? But yeah, my food getting cold. Man, shout out to Natural J Notification Squad. I see you, bro. I gotta shout you out. All right, next question. I had to look some up. College name. Yeah, I'm not telling y'all the college name because <laughs> a lot of y'all dudes on some weird shit. Like, y'all go in look up these girls and try and stalk them and talk to them like bro we're not doing that <laughs> i'll tell you that right now we're not doing that this is day for day bro we're not we're not searching down johns <laughs> and you know i know they'll do it because one of my friends actually did it he hit me like yo bro 
I added this girl. I'm like, <laughs> dude, it's just a video, bro. It's not that serious to be looking up these joints. And I'm not telling you guys any colleges. I live on an island. If you know what an island is, and you know the colleges around, and you luckily find one of them, congratulations. But other than that, we're not talking about that. I guess this is a question. I don't know if it's a statement, but they said, do you really need validation this badly? Um, let me screenshot this one so I can put on a video. No, I don't need validation. I mean, anybody that knows me or, you know, around me in my personal life, no, I'm not looking for validation. Um, these videos are here to motivate you. You know what I'm saying? Even to rate me from one to 10, that's just to attract the audience. You understand what I'm saying? Like it's entertainment, but at the same time, you know, the way this channel is going to be going and the route I'm going on, it's all for entertainment and all for motivation. You know what I mean? There's people just like how you may think, oh, he's showing off this, that, and the third. There's also people that will be motivated like, wow, I need to get into the gym. What is this guy doing in the gym? Can I can I learn from him? Can he can he teach me something? You know what I'm saying? You can take you can take something from every person, whether it's negative or positive. It just depends on how you perceive that. You know what I'm saying? If you perceive it as negative, it's gonna be something negative that you're taking from them. But if you perceive what they're doing as positive, you know, that's the direction you'll be steered. In. So I know most of you guys that are subscribed, I'm not even talking about you guys. I'm just answering like some questions just to add to the video. Because I, I don't even understand these questions sometimes. I just look at them and it's just like, <laughs> these guys are really crazy. But anyways, uh, I'm gonna keep the videos coming. Y'all stay tuned. And until next time, stay patient, but never complacent. And take things day for day. You know I'm a hot boy, but I